Hey guys, welcome back to another serving of food for thought. Of course, not everything in this reading will resonate for you, so I encourage you to take what does and leave the rest. However, if this resonates or you just so happen to like this reading, let me know by commenting down below or liking this video. So let's jump right in, you guys. Holy Spirit, what is the message here for the collective energy? Someone is wanting to attract your energy. Hmm. So this is a very unconventional energy, unconventional soul who is wanting you to soften your heart when it comes to them or their harsh ways. This is someone who is now struggling alone, going through a dark night of the soul. This is someone who is suffering or in a space of scarcity. There is no abundance while you are divinely protected. I feel this is someone who has their heart or their thoughts all in knots while things are slowly or heavily unveiling to them. This is someone who also has a distorted view of themselves or even you. I feel this is someone who has a very distorted view of themselves while you are mastering your own energy or mastering self while this energy is wanting to circle back to you. This is someone who wants to circle back while still wallowing in their own sins and mistakes where there are heavy lessons where this energy is dealing with a lot hmm. something is definitely getting in the way for many of you this is outside interferences possibly even karmic energies if not this is just a toxic environment that this energy has fall prey to this is someone who is going through uncomfortable karma hmm possibly on the run or vibing solo, but this energy is in a space where they feel they have fallen too deep, in over their head, and drowning in unstable emotions or feelings. This is someone who is dealing with um, some uncomfortable things, thoughts, emotions, because they were hyper-focused on finances or material things. This is someone who's dealing with a lot of unstable relationships, codependent patterns, and very desperate and controlling ways. Now this energy realizes something valuable about you, which is no one else compares. This is someone who is having lucid dreams about you lucid dreams of when it was you against the world with this energy or the deep conversations that you had with this energy Food for thought yet now something three. is silent left a mystery hmm. let's get a little bit more energy here on this bit. there's a message message here for the collective Many of you, this is someone who went ghost or silent on you because there was a lot going on within their spirit as well as within their mind state. This energy gave into some weaknesses, possibly in despair now over the choices they made. Hmm. This is someone who failed to understand a truth. Someone with a heavy guard over their heart is starting to see a truth starting to grow tired of their own tough exterior as it has caused them to gain very little yet they have lost so much let me get a little bit more energy here for confirmation from a different day I feel there's a lot of differences in this situation this person's not being honest or truthful lies yeah Holy Spirit, what is the message here? Hot and cold energy. Yeah, this energy is burnt out. This energy is burnt out. Tired of their own shit at this point. This is someone who is extremely inconsistent. Someone who has betrayed your trust through lies, betrayal, and deceit. For many of you, this is someone who has told bold lies to your face. Hmm. But something they did was too big 
and it was bound to fail. There was no planning, there was no stability, there, there, there was no foundation within a situation and this person knows they have hit their peak. Their glory days are over. Hmm. I feel like this is someone who is burnt out, upset about some losses. I feel you are amongst the many. I feel like it's a bitter pill to swallow when it comes to this energy who has some type of behavioral issues or they're just upset. Upset after actively antagonizing a situation with you, putting you in competition, trying to win at all costs. I feel this is someone who was trying to strategize. Hmm. But I feel this energy did something with overload. Too much, too fast. I feel you were caught up in a way. Mm. I feel you were in a bad place when you were in this person's hands. This is someone who wants to run back to your energy. But something is definitely a bitter, bitter pill to swallow. This energy may be a little upset, angry. Because they know they lost something with you. Something real. Something they can't just buy or gain from someone else. This is something that is unique to your energy, unique to your blessings, your worth, your life. This is someone who wanting, is wanting to run back to you knowing that you have unconditional love, yet they have tyrant energy of someone being cruel uh, or oppressive. This is someone who is indifferent to your energy because they allow others to put a key in their back. Now this energy is salty, bitter, or upset with you because now they are the ones who feel rejected. This is someone who either feels rejected or, or is not in a space of want, being rejected. This person thought they were going to finesse their way out of something, finesse their way out of a missed call or being unresponsive. This is someone who tried to disassociate themselves with you avoided you now they're stressed and going through crisis because they fell into some type of thirst trap now there's a separation or divide within a connection where you may have cleaned house and this energy refused change i feel like this is someone who only prolonged their own energy their own pain and misery this is someone with a lot of anger issues toxic bonds Hmm. or someone with extreme highs and extreme lows who is overthinking their hardship and losses. I feel like they are overthinking their hardship and losses to the point where they have checked out or they're starting to lose hope as they're starting to blame everyone but themselves for their pain and sacrifices. But I feel these are not truly sacrifices at all. Hmm. Because they, they are the very ones causing their own misery through smoke and mirrors. Trying to smooth talk their way out of a situation, but it's going nowhere. In fact, I feel this person has been pinpointed or called out. This is someone who's going through some very heavy financial issues. Possibly even issues with their car or their job. Please take it how it resonates. But there's some scarcity within their life. After playing a game of scare tactics with you. Now this energy is isolated. Financially blocked. Feeling homeless. Or feeling like there's no place like home. This is someone who greatly disappointed you by following others. Sheep-like energy. Wanting to be seen. Hmm. Thinking they were too big to fail. Now this energy is wanting to run away from their problems. Because they were too difficult to please. Now they're drowning in their own misery. Feeling like they're standing out. Knowing one thing is not like the other. I feel this is poetic justice. Retribution. Now this energy is feeling like 
there is no way out because they're in too deep. I feel like they're left for dead because there's too many burdens. Something is mounting, the pressures that are mounting when it comes to finances or legal activity. This is someone who feels they no longer exist in your life. They've been kicked out, let go, but they feel attracted to you still. A divine feminine energy. Someone they didn't respond to when you needed them. They gaslighted you. They left you on red. Now they feel they've been cursed. Hmm. They feel like they've been cursed for spreading lies, creating chaos, causing worry, and triggering fears. This is someone who tried to finesse their way out of a problem, cutting ties, cutting ties, a masculine energy cut ties here. This doesn't have to be a male energy who cut ties. This could be a feminine energy sitting in masculine energy who cut ties. But this energy feels like something was exposed and you've already moved on. You've moved on from the smoke and mirrors, not allowing them to finesse you with the emotional history of this connection. The fact that they were a tyrant or not respecting their position, they lost or blew their chance. I feel like this is someone who turned their back on you. They turned their back on this connection or did something in the worst possible way while projecting their own character and also accusing you, accusing you of things they know they did, but they would never admit it and they will always deny. But I sense this energy would blame anything and anyone else before seeing the truth of their own actions. This is the energy of them antagonizing situations but not wanting to be rejected. I feel this is where this bitter energy is coming from because it's a hard pill to swallow to understand what they truly let go because there was no one who compared to you in the end. Mm. However, now there is true regret and remorse even though they won't show that to you, yet they're lost or delayed in the current circumstances because they're, they've been too trapped in this anger in these sinful ways for so long trying to please and be pleased they lost their way I feel like this energy lost your trust and respect in so many ways mm. now it's Whatever's going on is no longer what they want or what they need. And they're trying to find a way out, a safe space. Hmm. And for many of you, all they can think about is the unconditional love they didn't take. Now that the respect is no longer there, which is worse than you being mad at them, but what can they do? They've done too much and done too little for your respect. For many of you, this is someone who still is in a space of being mesmerized by you. Feel like your love is breathe. electric. This energy is missing you in silence. Careless actions. This energy is flaky when it comes to love very irresponsible behaviors here of someone who is still nostalgic about the past hmm. for some of you this is someone who feels you have a very captivating aura but they let time they let time slip away this is someone who did not honor the mind body and soul they wore a mask and everything is not what it appears when it comes to them. In fact, I feel they are sitting in a silent space trying to cope. 
while there's lessons in progress. I feel like this is someone who is questioning everything. They're questioning everything they attach themselves to or even their bruised ego because there's no way home hmm. or there will be a long way home because there is heavy regret. They're replaying events and realizing they are the ones who went against the grain. Allowed these third parties to invade the space and now they regret that they're on their own and going through some very uncomfortable karma. This is someone who is going through some very uncomfortable karma for their sins, now wanting to circle back, wanting you to see them in a different light, but yet this energy feels they need to focus on their stability and their foundation, which is bleak and fading away. Now they regret walking away out of spite or ignorance as they just want to see if you could see them as you used to. Which I feel for some, some of you, it may, it may take some time. And for others, there's no chance. I feel there's no chance for change as they have already blown their chances. I feel this is someone who has already blown their chances with a once in a lifetime opportunity that they may never get again. I hope you guys have enjoyed the reading and has found some food for thought. If so, let me know by commenting down below or liking this video. I hope to see you again, guys. Bye.